Hello my loves, it's Kasha Planerista 101 and it is time for a plan with me in my journal. Thank you so much for joining me if you are coming back to my channel and as always thank you so much for spending your precious time with me and if you are new, welcome, I really hope you like it here. So today we are planning for the week of December 13th through the 19th and I am going to be using the Live Love Posh sticker books. They're just absolutely gorgeous and it's a week before Christmas so I wanted to do something nice and cozy and really fun for my planner especially because my journal is just one of my favorite pieces of my planner. I get to pour out my heart in there so it's it's really awesome to be able to do that okay so live the posh i was thinking about these realistic snowmen but i can even use that in january so let's leave that be but this really cozy spread is so beautiful i cannot contain myself so here we go i'm going to go ahead and add um, this little scene and I'm going to create this spread and especially because of the colors the colors are red and green but they're also there's a lot of gray in here as well which again like I love my muted tones so look how pretty this is we have that girl in front of the Christmas tree and all of these beautiful beautiful things so look at these like Pride and Bre Prejudice, the Nutcracker um, just really vogue like really really beautiful book stack and then these decorations are just to die for. So I'm creating a very, very quick spread just with those things. So it's a very bookish, cozy type of thing. I really like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and continue making those. There we go. Some ornaments. Some macaroons because just because. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna add a few more ornaments, maybe like right there. I think that might work. So with this planner, I really don't have like a set way of decorating. I just do whatever looks good because I never know what I'm going to be journaling about or how much room I will need. And sometimes I spill into another day and that's okay as well. And I'm going to be using the um, neutral Mojo Jojo boxes. So that gray, I think really, really sits well with the gray in the spread so i'm going to go ahead and add some of the journaling boxes into here like so so i'm just going to lift up those stickers just a tiny bit to expose all the corners to be able to fit the box underneath and decorations on top so three stickers, there we go. Okay, that's great. And now I can close the flaps. Here we go. Okay, same thing on the other side. I would like to add a large 
journaling box. I really have been enjoying journaling in those big boxes. Initially, I wasn't sure um, if I'm going to be liking huge boxes like that in my journal and kind of limiting myself to a spot, but I really don't mind going over the box and just continuing to write. So I think that's the only reason why I'm okay with having all of these little boxes all over the place. Okay, so this one is not as easy to peel up. So I'm going to go ahead and do that really quickly and add another box. So it almost looks like they're edge to edge, but they're split up with decorations and then close the flaps again and there we go i think that looks pretty great now i'm gonna be playing with smaller pieces of boxes and just kind of filling in the spread as i see it necessary so i'm gonna go ahead and add a box to a wednesday and then I'm going to add a header to that one and instead of putting it right in the middle like normally, I'll do it a little off of center and I'll overlap these. And I think that that looks pretty decent. Let's see. It's kind of straight today. Ooh, what a good day. Okay, I need a couple more little pieces, not too much, just to fill in a couple little gaps. Okay, we're almost done. I'm going to overlap a box right there to create the same overlapping look. I'm going to add a box to Monday and then overlap it with Tuesday like so. And then right here. And then one more on Friday like this. Okay, now I think I am done. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys very soon for another plan with me. Thank you so much for watching and have a great week. Bye.